In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create attribute sections inside of the widget creator. Let's get started. Hi, and thanks for joining. It's Amit from Unlimited Elements. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to organize your attributes into attribute sections. So first of all, I want to explain what an attribute section is. When we close this general part and have this button part over here, these are two different attribute sections. Also, if you jump into styles, you'll see that you have different sections over here and all the attributes are separated into sections. So I'm going to show you how to create your own sections, organize them, and move attributes between different attribute sections. So I'm jumping into the widget creator. If you're not familiar with the widget creator, please check out our different beginner tutorials in our YouTube channel and you'll start getting familiar with it. So over here in general, we have all sorts of attributes and by default, you're, or you're going to only have general over here and you can create as many parts as you want over here. You can make content attribute sections or style attribute sections. So if we jump back in to Elementor Page Builder, over here you'll see content and style. So that's the difference between content and style over here. To create a new section, you just click plus and you can give that a name. Click add section. Now notice that you can also reorder this. So the way you will reorder it over here will be the exact same way it will be represented over here in the same order. So this is really important. At any time, you can also click on a new section and edit it. You can change the name if you want, or you can delete a section if you need to delete it. Make sure to notice that if you're going to delete a section with attributes, that will delete the attributes inside, so be careful. So. The next thing I'm going to show after we've created a new section, now I want to move my attribute inside of this section. So for this, we have the move mode button. I'm gonna click on that. Now over here, instead of draggable attributes, I have a checkbox next to each attribute. So I'm just gonna click on this one, button radius. And over here, we see sort of a circle that shows us that we can move to any one of these attribute sections. I'm going to move it to the new attribute section that I've created. So I need to click on this little pulsing circle, click on that one. So now you can see that in general, instead of five attributes, we have just four attributes and the new attribute has moved to the new attribute section. I'm gonna click update to save. And let's just jump into Elementor Page Builder, refresh our page builder, and check out how this looks in the live page builder. So I'm just gonna click on that. And now you can see we have a new attribute section called new. I'm gonna click on that. And now you can see that we've moved our attribute into the new section. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and I'm gonna see you in the next video.